Each time we hear the name of Jesus, we, take, we make some sort of physical gesture by taking a bow. Why? Is it as a sign of respect or are we just doing it? Welcome to Know Your Faith series. I am Collins and today we will be talking about why we bow when we hear the name of Jesus. The custom is biblically inspired and was instituted by Pope Gregory X in the 13th century. Now, there are many bodily gestures that we make as Catholics, and in one of the episodes of KYF, we talked about the reason why we genuflect. And this particular reason why we bow our heads at the name of Jesus, we can trace the origin of this custom to the words of St. Paul to, to the Philippians. In Philippians 2, from verses 9 to 11, which says, Therefore God has highly exalted him and bestowed on him the name which is above every name, that at the name of Jesus every knee must bow and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. Now, practically speaking, it would be rather difficult to actually bend the knee and, over it and confess that Jesus Christ is Lord at every time you hear the name of Jesus. So, uh, Pope Gregory X found a solution to this. And he wrote about it to the Dominicans and to the Dominican order in 1274, expressing that it is necessary to actually give certain physical gestures to honor Jesus' name. Now he explained that at the mention of Jesus, everyone would bow his head in a token that interiorly he bends the knee of heart. So even when we bow our head, we are actually showing or we are expressing the sign of reverence to Jesus' name. The Dominicans took the Pope's request seriously and became the foremost promoters of the Holy Name, going out and preaching out the name of Jesus. The custom is a simple one and is meant to reflect an interior desire to honor Jesus, the only name which we are saved by. So that's it for today, guys. The simple reason why we bow our heads, like I said, can be traced to the words of St. Peter himself in Philippians chapter 2, verses 9 to 11. And Pope Gregory X explained that even when bowing our heads, we are bending the knees of our heart and showing reverence to Christ himself. So thank you for joining us today. I hope that you did learn a couple of things. So till I come your way next time, be bold and be Catholic.